So if you want to make professional quality videos, one of the first things you're going to need is some great video editing software. If you're on the Microsoft Windows platform, this can be really confusing as there's so many different packages to choose from. So today we're going to save you time, cut through all that research. It doesn't matter if you're a pro and you want to make slick footage with animations and effects, or you're an amateur and you just want to sling some footage together with some transitions and titles and a bit of music. We're going to show you the only two packages you should consider on the Microsoft Windows platform. So the first package we'd recommend for those movie editing in Windows is Microsoft Movie Maker. It's easy to use and it's free. Let's take a look. So if you're just starting out video editing and you want to do some minor alterations to your videos, what better place to start than with Microsoft Movie Maker? And the best thing about this program is, it's completely free. So this is a really simple program to use. Basically, you just drag in any video clip, music clip, or picture you want to add. Once you've added the media you want and organized it in the correct order, you can then add transitions and titles and other effects to your movie. And the results this program generates are semi-professional and look great. So if you're willing to skip the more advanced features and stick with the basics, you can produce a very professional looking video and record time with Microsoft Movie Maker. And because it's free, it's often the tool of choice for beginning and intermediate YouTubers. We think you'd be surprised that a significant amount of professional looking YouTube videos that you've watched have been made using this program. So the other package we'd recommend on the Microsoft Windows platform for the slightly more professional video editor is Adobe Premiere. It's a great package with loads of features and all the bells and whistles required to create slick commercial productions like you'd see on television or high-end YouTube videos. Let's take a look. So for those looking for fully featured video editing software on the Microsoft Windows platform, you can do no better than Adobe Premiere Pro. You'd be very surprised by just how many of the amazing videos you've seen on YouTube or on commercial TV that are made using this software. So let me tell you, Premiere really is awesome. It's extremely powerful with all the features, and even when you're editing on a big commercial project, it's still fast. Premiere really has too many features to list in this video, but sufficient to say it's got all the features the modern video editor needs. From transitions to animated title sequences to mixing audio tracks, Premiere really does have it all. And anyone familiar with the popular Adobe product range will immediately feel at home with the standard Adobe CC workspace that you can customize to your needs. It also integrates great with the other Adobe products like Photoshop or Illustrator if you want to add some images or titles. Premiere is also designed to use with Adobe After Effects. So what this means is if you link up After Effects to Adobe Premiere, you have a great platform to create movie special effects. Maybe you want to liven up the intro of your movies by shooting some fireballs from your fingertips. Whatever you want, it's all there with the Adobe Shoot. One last great feature I want to talk about with Premiere is it's really efficient and quick at rendering movies. Once you've fully rendered a movie once, you can use a feature called Use Previews, which means it doesn't re-render stuff it's already rendered. This is great when you render your movie and you watch it, you notice some mistakes, you want to go back and edit it, but you don't have the time to render the full movie all over again. This feature becomes a real time saver. If you're looking to edit video on the Windows platform and you've got some money, you really can't do better than buying yourself a copy of Adobe Premiere Pro. I hope you guys found that video entertaining or at least informative. If you did and you're interested in more videos about content creation, video production, please give us a like or a subscribe. As always, catch you next time.